hi gods and goddesses <laughs> i'm using my new camera right now so hopefully this is a good angle and better sound because my boyfriend my partner bought me a new camera the sony camera um that you'll see in a vlog so let me lower down the music all right I'm so excited. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Let's get started with the haul. Oh yeah, first remember to subscribe if you're new here. And yeah, there's links down below in the description box if you're interested on any of these items. My eBay and Poshmark are linked down below. Or you can search them by name. I also write it down down there. And I also have Instagram if you're interested. If you have Instagram, you can follow me. First we have these Aria shoes. <laughs> the lighting is a little weird. They're a 10B. I haven't cleaned them. I barely got these yesterday. They're just basic shoes. <laughs> I don't know. Gotta condition the leather a little bit. Oh my gosh. When I found this picture vase thing, I was like so happy because... Lately, I've been really liking birds. Oh shit, I didn't notice that. This is really old, so um, I just noticed it has a little bit of damage right here. You could tell. That was not there before. Oh, I must have banged it. I'm sorry. I love this bird though, this parrot. If I could have a parrot to talk to, that would be a dream come true. <laughs> And it has another bird over here, but I don't know what kind of bird this is. Obviously, this is a pitcher. You could use it as holes, but it's missing the top, which is why I thought it would be really nice as a vase. So you can put water in it and then real flowers in your kitchen. Wouldn't that be beautiful? I prefer the parrot, but I don't know. They're both really nice. Right? Yeah, they're gorgeous. So the brand is called Royal Ironstone China. These will be going in my fridge once my man buys me a fridge <laughs> and a home and everything. <laughs> oh, this top I really want to keep as well. It does have some stains, but it's vintage, so it's a, it's all right with me. How cute would I look with this? This shirt I'm wearing right now is vintage as well, and it's thrifted as well. But look at this graphic. obsessed pretty lightweight so it'd be good for california i live in california um i didn't see any flaws with it it's just really pretty typical lily pulitzer like really colorful whatever last but not least we have some cashmere by ll bean and it's just a little pullover i'm falling off the chair it's just a little, um, these are the personal items that I'm getting rid of in my own closet. Just because, um, I keep shopping for myself when I thrift to resell. So the first item is this drag pants. They're like a light velour, not too thick. And these are pretty big. They're kind of loose on me. They're 12, a size 12. And they're like a boot cut, kind of like a wide leg. And I love this detail on the pocket here. Yeah, so these are going and they do have some stretch in them. And then this velour top is vintage. It's like a full button down shirt by Partners in a woman's medium. And it has little floral print. It's like a maroon with purple flowers. It looks brown, but it's more maroon, I think. Yeah. And then I have a turtleneck long sleeve top in a woman's medium, I think. Yeah, by Ralph Lauren. And I, I really, I really wanted to like um, turtlenecks for winter, but it's just not for me. It's really pretty. There's nothing wrong with it. It's just not for me. And it's a relaxed medium, so not too fitted. Although it, it, it was like choking me, which I usually like, but. Not like all day, all day, <laughs> you know. 
I don't want to be choked all day. Well, what's the other bag? All right, one more bag and then I'm done. Oh yeah, I found these really cute uh, knit pants by exclusively Misuk. I also have a dress by this brand, but it still hasn't moved, which is kind of weird because it's like a higher end brand. Here's the label. They are large. And hand wash acceptable. And they're just really pretty, like vintage masuk. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. There's nothing wrong with it. It's a straight leg. It's relaxed. It's stretchy. Comfortable knit pants. I tried them on, but they were not very flattering on me. Because vintage does run smaller. So I would say it's more for like someone who's like a medium. Like in a size, dream size, 8, 10. And I'm a 10, 12 right now. Oh yeah, these were doing really well. This is the first time I find these pants. But they are by Driftwood. Driftwood in a medium. And these are joggers. Camouflage with embroidered flowers on them. I have a Universal Threads New with Tags dress. This is a maxi dress. With a big sleeve big half sleeve here it's bohemian um very pretty all over print it's really big really long it's a maxi and it's a large next i have a skirt with daffy duck on it because i thought it was a really cute print and this is from the salvation army as well i think this is just by lula Rowe, and i kind of wanted to try this on it's a large Focus, focus. Thank you. But yeah, it's like all over print, like tight pencil skirt, but it's stretchy. But it's stretchy. It's like comfortable. It looks like it's not going to be uncomfortable, but it is. Okay, I'll try it on. Whatever. And then I found some really pretty, like going to a wedding or something, dresses. <laughs> Tahari, size 14. What happened? You were doing so well. You were doing so well, camera. Okay. And it's just like metallic, really pretty fitted, fitted dress. I just love the color. I guess it's like kind of like abstract. I don't see any flowers. But it's like metallic. It's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. The camera's not doing it any justice. Am I getting the right angles here? Anyway. I have plenty of dresses. These are... I've had this bag in my freaking tub for so long I don't even know what's in it this is beyond yoga leggings this this brand does tend to move pretty quickly I saw the little romper by them before like in a week and the little scrunch is it scrunchy? scrunch scrunchy? So, <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying I think they're small I am beyond flexible alright I would say they're small. I don't see a tag. Um, they're just black basic. A little peeling between the thigh area, which is to be expected with used leggings. Here we have another dressy dress by Liz Claiborne Career in a size 16. Focus. Okay, well you get it. It's just another really pretty. This one's more flowy and floral and it's gorgeous. Oh my god, I love this print and these colors. It's dark. Oh, it matches with my hair. <laughs> oh, okay, it's gonna fall. But yeah, just this Claiborne Career zip zips in the back, I think. <sighs> There's my cats, and here we have a beach dress. It's vintage. It's by Prophecy by Sag Harbor in a woman's size 10. I tried this one on, and it was too tight on me on my hips. And lower belly area so I had to list I have to list it it zips up in the back it's just really pretty print like tribal Aztec beachy animal print it's just a whole mix of things that are just like so good and I'm very sad that it does not fit me right now but it'll fit somebody who has less curvage <laughs> with butt less hips or it's just thinner like 120 pounds or 130 pounds Lastly, 
we have another dress that I was going to keep but then I decided to list it because I don't want to be selfish and getting high off my own supply. This is by Bo Beau. It's just a Nordstrom brand and a woman's size medium. It's beautiful. It's relaxed. I'm pretty sure it's, yeah, this is a wrap dress. Ties. So you have to tie it all around and it's very long. It's a maxi. And look at this print. It's so pretty. So pretty. And it does have some lining. But not fully. So it's going to be lightweight, uh, breathable. And yeah, um, I'm being nice by letting this one go because you know how much I love florals. But I just have so many vintage dresses already that my closet is like not even accepting new applications at this time. What is up with this sad song? I don't want a sad song. California Dreaming, I guess that's alright. I think that's it. I think that's everything. How long have I been going on for? 16 minutes. Yay, I can keep track now. This camera doesn't shut down on me like my old camera did. Um, should I try some stuff on? Nah, I'll just cut it short. I don't want it to be longer than 15, 14 minutes. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to check out my eBay and Poshmark if you want any of these items. By the time you should see this, I, I hope to God that I would have listed them by now. Um, yeah, bye. Love you guys. Well, I got down on my...